everybody. This is December the 31st, last day of the year, 2022. Uh, it's not every day you get to see ducks in the bathtub. Look at that. Oh my goodness, I'm in Wallonia, Kentucky. I'm at the home of Daniel and Virginia Spindler, AJ's homeschooling teachers. And, and it's not every day that you get to see ducks in the bathtub. Now, how old are these ducks now? Uh, they're about two weeks, I think. Oh, are they, are they, are they only two weeks old? Mm -hmm. No way. No, they seem, I can't believe they're only two weeks old. And the actually they were born on uh on Dan's birthday, right? Yeah, Dan's birthday. So yeah. they're about a month old then, yeah. I guess. Dan's birthday is December the third. Yeah. They were both born about December the third, right? Yeah. So yeah, so they'll be a month old on January third. So um I, the colors are so amazing on them. They are absolutely amazing. Um and what is the yellow one's name? Ivory. Ivory. And then is it ebony? Mm-hmm. So they are natural swimmers. Oh yeah. So how old were they when you first introduced them to water? I waited a few days. They were a couple of days old. All right. And just put them in a little bit of water. That is absolutely amazing. Of course, in the in the summer, you have those little kiddie pools in the summer. Yeah. Where that, they can uh, play in the kiddie pools. Yeah. In the, in the summer. But it's it's not good weather for them to do no. it. and they need water so that's why we brought them into the bathtub yeah and i put some mealworms over in there and they that's all this stuff floating around oh wow so they're like uh, practicing diving for mealworms and now they're they're bathing right now oh <laughs> <laughs> And so they they instantly know what water is instantly, right? When you first introduce them to it. Mm -hmm. So so the same, like leading ducks to water. There you go. Um, but now normally, I, I think of you know we think about babies being born in the spring and summer. So I guess it must be extra hard that they were born in the winter. I guess as far as getting them like normally you'd have them outside, right? Um, in the kiddie pools. Oh, wow. So, these, they are definitely a pair, then, aren't they? Mm hmm They'll have that, they'll have their that own bond, little... that own click group. Mm -hmm. So, so they're bathing and drinking and playing in it. Mm -hmm. Oh, well, that's quite a responsibility to have to do this every day? No, not, I don't do it every day. It's just, like, every other day or just a couple of times a week. I don't like having to bleach the tub out that many times. Yeah. 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 It's fun to watch them. I mean, you just don't think about ducks being in the bathtub. <laughs> They're precious. They're precious, precious, precious. So, AJ has been... Um, exposed to so many wonderful things these past several months of getting to see chickens born, ducks born, getting to see rabbits and guineas and uh, turkeys and um, just uh, well, I was. Uh, do you uh, do you, do you wish that you had horses and cows and all of that? Uh, yeah, I wish I had a little few things, but not a lot of them. I guess the birds are a big enough responsibility. You don't really, um, you'd be, oh, yeah. having a horse, it's a whole different ball game, I guess. But just, uh, Virginia has, uh, how many birds do you have? Do you know offhand? Uh, got 23 chickens, three guineas, and a turkey. Wow. That's a lot. And they survived the cold. They oh, yeah. they survived. You had put hay out there and they survived all of that. Mm -hmm. So um, they did better than you probably expected them to do. That's nice. Virginia got out there and she made sure that all her birds had hay. Uh, and it lined up in the coop house and very well insulated. Being a good mama to her barnyard birds. And so they survived the Arctic blast. It sure felt like one, didn't it? Yeah. Well, okay. Can you tell, can you say goodbye, birdies? It sure has been fun watching you. It'll be fun to watch you grow up, too, and you'll be big in no time. If that's how big you are in a month, 
Man, I can't imagine. Well, I've already seen with the other ones how fast they grow. Yeah, oh man, they are so spoiled too. Stop it. Are you getting dried off? Oh my goodness, are you getting dried off? <laughs> they, that's a loud, that's yep. a loud squeak. Yeah. That's a loud squeak. All oh, right. he's taking it pretty good. Come here, Isla. I know, I know. I know. <laughs> You're loud, aren't you? You're loud. All right, go on.